Hey there, what's up? It is day two of the Blue Cut Fire in San Bernardino County, and it's grown to over 30,000 acres, forcing tens of thousands of evacuations. Hello, if you're new to me, I'm Kerry Shearer, the live stream expert. My background is in video, broadcast media, public information and marketing, and I'm all about helping agencies and businesses and entrepreneurs effectively implement the new wave of social media, which is live streaming. And I'm down here in San Bernardino County to conduct my live stream Impact Academy workshop, which was to have been held at the Emergency Operations Center, but guess what? It got canceled at the last minute when the EOC was activated as a result of the fire, which started about 10.38 a.m. on August 16th. Now, firefighters are making a huge effort to control the wind whip blaze, and San Bernardino County Public Information Officer Eric Sherwin did an amazing job on Periscope, taking viewers right to the fire lines. Presently, uh, hundreds of firefighters uh, attached to this incident. Fire is being managed under unified command between the U.S. Forest Service and San Bernardino County Fire. We have numerous evacuations in place affecting a number of communities. This fire, as it came through the Cajon Pass, uh, got up into uh, a number of canyons. Mandatory evacuation is in place north of Highway 138, south of Phelan Road. We have a second evacuation mandatory between Highway 138 to the south Ranchero Road to the north that extends east out to Summit Valley Road. Events like this fire are perfect for social media live streams to keep the public informed, answer questions in real time. You know, I haven't seen any live updates yet from the Emergency Operations Center or news conferences, but if you're an emergency communicator, real time is where it's going on social media to keep the public informed and communicate clearly and authentically. Now, it's one thing to kick out a tweet or a PDF news release. It's totally different experience, though, to have a real human on screen in front of you telling you what's happening right now, giving you information, taking feedback, and answering questions. Now, one of the pieces of technology that makes it really easy is the tiny Mevo live event camera. It's brand new. I used it on the fire to show the smoke uh, just from the rooftop of my rental car, I went live on Facebook and showed the massive plume of smoke rising from the hills. Now, even though it's just a stationary camera, it's got a high definition sensor and that allows you to choose a number of different camera shots to kind of zoom in or zoom out and really do a multi-camera production, which is a whole lot of capability in a $399 product. So that's what's happening down here in San Bernardino County with the fire. I just wanted to give you an update on what's going on. If you're not following me, you can follow me on Twitter and Periscope at Kerry Shearer, on Facebook Live forward slash Kerry Shearer fan, and of course my website is kerryshearer.com. And hey, if you're interested in any of the kind of tech that I use for live streaming, you can go to my livestreamtechstore.com page. That's where I list and show all of the equipment that I use. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you next time.